Hi everybody, this is Cub the Tool Man, and today I want to talk to you about a heating system. I know a lot of you out there saying, how come a plumber is talking about a heating system? I thought that was for a heat guy. Well, the fact is, that us plumbers, we install heating systems, all of it, from the zones to the boiler and the radiation heat inside the house. Now, what we don't do is we don't do the wiring, and we also don't do the troubleshooting on a heating system. But anyway, what I want to show you today, this is a four-zone system, which here I'll show you. Okay, there's four zones here. There's one, two, three, four. Now, these are circulators, okay? Now, normally, these circulators are on the other side of the heating system, not on the top. These are pushing, okay? Instead of pushing down, they're pushing up. Here, I'll show you what I mean. Okay, as you can see, the circulators, okay, and they're numbered. And what it's doing is it's pushing up this way and going through the boiler. Now, normally, the circulators on this side of the boiler on the return lines. You can see there's four. One, two, three, four. Now, they usually push down. The person that installed this boiler, they put the circulators on the top of the boiler, which is okay, okay? It's just some people are different. What I do is I like to push, put them on the other side of the boiler so they're pushing down, but they all work on the same principle. But anyway, I want to get too complicated here, but I'm going to go through a scenario here in case you're at home out there and have a problem with your heating system. What happens when you come home and you find on this floor here okay and there's water all over the floor here and the water is coming from here okay I don't know if you can see that right there or not okay this is the, this is a relief valve it works by temperature and pressure what happens is if there's too much pressure in this boiler and it's creating too much pressure it will blow off and it'll blow off on the ground okay now you ask where is that coming from well, it's not, what I'm going to show you is that it, it's, this tank is not working properly, which is called the extral tank. It's a holdings tank or an expansion tank, which is this little jewel right here. Okay, what happens is when this boiler, and it builds up too much pressure, and there's too much water pressure, and it will blow off on that relief valve, which is almost like being constipated, okay? It has to go somewhere. So what it does, it's supposed to go into this little tank right here. And, and if it doesn't, then it's blowing off on the floor. So, what's the problem? The problem is, is this tank, okay? Inside this tank, okay, there's a bladder in there, all right? Just, just like in your body, okay? And there's a bladder inside this tank. And what happens is when this breaks, it fills up and it, water, it gets waterlogged. So what you have to do is you have to replace this tank and shut the boiler off and unscrew it and put another tank on and uh, that will solve your problem. It should solve it anyway. But anyway, uh, next time we'll talk about something else on the heating system uh, if something goes wrong. Anyway, you take care and this is Cub Tool Man and I hope you learned something today. Take care. Mike, take care of yourself. Bye now.